Ride 7 ATV and motorcycle riders swarming the streets of South Florida, weaving in and out of traffic, performing dangerous stunts, as you can see, putting their lives and the lives of pedestrians and other motorists at risk. And then there was this dramatic encounter between a rider and an FHP trooper, the officer pulling out what appears to be a stun gun, pushing the rider and the rider's passenger off of that bike. Eventually, at least two other riders kicked the officer's vehicle in retaliation. And right now, Chopper 4 live over the scene, hovering this area around US-1. Chopper 4 will be flying and will continue to monitor the activities throughout this newscast. And one rider critically injured in a wipeout yesterday. Several arrests have been made and at least one firearm was confiscated. CBS 4's Mike Cugno is live for us at Northwest Miami-Dade with some of what we've seen so far. Mike? Yeah, guys, these riders have basically thrown these traffic laws right out the window. Today, right here on Northwest 27th Avenue, we saw ATV drivers riding against the grain of traffic, trying to avoid police officers. Unfortunately, it was a common sight we saw all across South Florida. The yearly tradition of wheels up, guns down has been an annual headache for law enforcement on South Florida's roads. Police officers are trying to keep streets safe while riders attempt risky maneuvers and even drive against the flow of traffic. Tensions heating up near 199th Street and 10th Avenue. FHP boxed these riders in, approached with a taser before shoving them to the ground. The riders would get back up and kick the cruiser before taking off. Uh, we're doing our best, folks. We're doing our best to uh, prevent it, to apprehend, to make arrests, and to, uh, to seize those motorcycles and take them off the road. In Hollywood, police released this video of seized bikes, saying they arrested five people and picked up 20 motorcycles. Officers in both counties understand the message, but the method, they say, is flawed. While I appreciate the message, why do I do not appreciate, and I think the, the vast majority in South Florida, the people that live here, what they don't appreciate is the fact that you're running red lights, you're cutting in and out of traffic, and you're creating a dangerous situation for everyone else. Residents agree, like the members of the motorcycle riders of South Florida. The message that they're putting out is a good message. What we want to say is actually do what y'all say. Do it safely. Exactly. Obey the law. That's it. If y'all going to ride up and down, ride up and down. But when you come to the light, do like the rest of us. Stop at the lights. Now, Miami-Dade Miami police say they have impounded 65 vehicles and have made 14 arrests throughout the day. In Northwest Miami-Dade, Mike Cuno, CBS 4 News.